spawn. Hello? Hello, who's this? You called me. This is the Califax Collection Company. Who am I speaking with? I know who you're looking for. He's not here. Do you know where he can be reached? What month is it? Um, it is June, I believe. Then he's probably in the Northern Hemisphere somewhere. Girl woke me up. Oh. Your girl. I don't have a girl here. Might be Swanks. Anybody coming today? I don't know. 85 might go through. I love airplanes. Fuck it, my daddy, he had me on the airplane. Your dad had you on an airplane. It was like that that weird Bill Cosby episode where with the he, Muppets, he, he gave gives birth, birth to sandwiches, like sandwiches and an exactly, orange Yeah, soda. but that was me on the airplane. It was weird. That sounds more like what's the one with Arnold Schwarzenegger and Oh yeah, with Danny DeVito. Danny, no, that's twins. Twins. I mean classics like regardless. The one where the guy where he's pregnant. Uh, baby mama. No nah, man. Uh, it's called uh, Kindergarten Cop Fuck. with Gary Coleman. Junior. Junior. It's really good. Junior. I don't know. Let's play it. I like it. I don't have it. Like, cause no one raps over that. I don't think so. The shuffle. The yeah. Shuffle business. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Your brother wants you. Mm. 
Cats too, bro. Come on, man. Is we gotta that do it for the A, though. Huh? We gotta do it for the A. Of course I do, man. Score a thousand, ten thousand points. All star. Your room yeah, is right. disgusting. It's not that crazy. Mm, that's the baby boy. But yo, Lisa swears that she's seen more vaginas than me in real life. In three. Listen. <laughs> I'm a woman. I'm in locker rooms, in Come like on. gyms, whatever. I see naked women all the time. Misla, since forever too. Not just since I hit puberty. Before puberty, I've been searching for naked women, and that's all. And since I'm here now, that's <laughs> all I do. Point. You got a point. About to say, man, how many vaginas have you accidentally seen? Wait, me? Both. Oh, yeah, I was gonna say it's never really an accident. It's not accident. <laughs> wow. It's not an accident for me either. What? <laughs> That's even weirder. <laughs> you guys are crazy. That makes no sense. You guys sent your girl down there to get me for this? <laughs> I didn't send girl down there. You got a girl here today? Uh-uh. Sweet. No, I didn't bring any girl. I'm, I'm looking for new girls. You got a girl downstairs? Of course she's not my girl. Why would I bring girls I'm here? Saying, Misa never brings girls for anybody. <laughs> mm. <Right>. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, yo, if that girl's cute, tell her to come upstairs, though. She wasn't scary enough? Mm -mm, you're not scary. <laughs> I'm pretty scary. Mm -mm, I can be scary when scary. I want to be. Try. Totally scary. Holy miss. decision is pivotal.
God damn it, did I just tweet? Oh, I just tweet. <laughs> God damn it! <laughs> He's a hat on push up. Go all the way down. Somebody make sure it goes all the way down. <laughs> 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 most like strangely recurring dreams over the last week and uh it's like of my wedding but nothing is going right everything's a disaster my guests are all there it's all my real life friends they all look gorgeous they're all like fully done up in their gowns that they're probably going to wear to the wedding my family's there but suddenly i realize i should have already been married by now and i'm not married i'm not in my wedding dress i'm all alone in this giant area where I see my guests being served their cocktail appetizers on paper plates. Everyone seems to be having a great time, but they're all dressed up eating off of paper plates. And I am wearing cargo pants, army cargo pants. Like Old Navy? Yeah, exactly, like Old Navy cargo pants. I don't own Old Navy cargo pants. I'm not even sure where that came from in my head, but I'm wearing that with a t-shirt and I'm supposed to be getting married. My hair's not done, my makeup's not done, everybody else is ready. My mom, comes in and asks me, why aren't you getting ready for your wedding? I'm like, oh, I will be, I will be. But suddenly I'm smoking a cigarette. I don't even know why I'm smoking a cigarette, but in my mind, I also know that I'm three or four weeks pregnant. Horrible, right? So I tell my mom, mom, you don't know this, but I'm three or four weeks pregnant. She says, not put out the cigarette. She says, well, maybe you should go get in your wedding dress. It's all very, very weird. I'm not really sure what it means at all. I think we have too many lemons. One more? Yeah. And these two. Yeah. Some of them. Okay. That'll be enough. Okay. We can make guacamole. Investing time and writing lies, likely truth without a clue. I met my higher self, pissing off the roof, a drunk and goofy set. Keep the mic smelly like a rotten tooth, and all your fears forgotten when the cap is in the booth. I'm an angel in an agony of flame, feathers growing at the mention of my name, the reinvention of my shame. I'm a slave to the darkness of my innermost cave, and all these words I hold tighter than a glow stick at a rave, nigga. Dance around the campfire, butt naked, blowing trees. Could give a single fuck if somebody sees I'm free. Red V bleed out a scarlet letter killer king and I'll be sitting ready for whatever weather the seasons sing. Picking up expensive habits, chasing after little rabbits, hope they lead me to a place of magic. Sad at all the times I never thought I had it, losing all these memories. Y'all are now it matters. Patterns. Uh, I 
mouth to a Pellegrino, bottle color of envy. Who the fuck is Gambino? I hand a waitress a Benji to act like she never met me. I'm saying though, they want the game changed when you shit on the radio. Fruit was so hanging low, I didn't even bother. She trying to land Obamas, man. She get it from her mama. I don't blame her. I tame her, give her something to visualize. On my couch watching DVR, American Dad. Man, them new Celine bags are so to die for her. Man, that Porsche on Prozac, them suicide doors. Watch her walk as the death becomes her. Cause Mrs. Tarantino killed Bills, no wonder. My heaven is the present, so maybe this is it. Pray to God every night to make me believe he exists. Drink a fifth of vodka, I don't need no sponsor. Hear the preacher holler, make them holy souls. And then that's when like the hook. Yeah, yeah, that's tight, I like that. Um, uh, you know, you, you got a little. Shit. Yeah. Shit. <laughs> wow. I remember being 17, being scared as hell, like getting prank calls, like crazy stuff. Just like a senior year of high school, had a lot of girls. Mm -hmm. It's crazy. So this one girl was super crazy. She would call my phone from a block number. I knew it was her. But then I started getting like the crazy, like death threats. Mm -hmm. Started as a joke. Then they knew exactly what kind of car I was driving. They knew exactly where I like to hang out. Then they started, you know, shooting in the area. So I couldn't sleep at home anymore. I went, got a gun for my friend. Now I'm sleeping on the street for a week. The scariest thing about it all though is like knowing that you have a gun. Mm -hmm. Is that you might have to use it. Yeah. Scarier than, the, than killing somebody is the thought of killing somebody just not knowing. Like those seven days, we right. couldn't handle it. Couldn't handle it. It's, you just get to that point, like you just, like how did I get here? Sometimes you just can't explain why things happen. They just, they just do. When I was like five or like six, we were like living like, I remember we were in Indicator, you know, the projects, like, on Common Drive. Like, it's real nice now, but, like, yeah. we were, like, I remember my mom's friend, like, it was, like, a friend of the family, had, like, this kid, like, something happened. I don't even, I didn't really understand it, but he had to, like, stay with us for, like, a couple of days. And we were, 
Like he, he we didn't have any space. We had like no room, so we had to sleep in my room, so we sleep in my bed. And he was like, I remember in the morning when we woke up, like he was like, let's rub butts. And, mm. and I was like, I was like, I don't, I, I just, I was like, I just did it. Cause I was like, oh, okay, like, I don't know what that means. Like, I don't really get it. And then, and then he like, and then when we turned and when I turned, like he kissed me. Kiss you? Yeah. Hmm. And then it was like, like, like you said, like, I don't know why that happened. I don't know why it happened. I don't know. Anybody ever like know about this? Nope. Just him. Just him. That's wild. It's weird. It's crazy. Like I said, sometimes you just can't explain things. I'm gonna go inside. Yeah, I'm gonna stay out here, man. Who are you?